Sorry for the uh, short interruption, but I have to see. Uh, I need to use that game file because I want to. I want to test something. Got a message? Doesn't matter. I want to go into Contos Dungeon. Do we have music here? We have. Very nice. I'm not interested in doing any of this Melta's friend stuff right now. I just want to get into that. Um, we don't need an invitation. Nobody talks to us like that. That's not helpful. You don't see the gravity, and it's a political affair. Very nice. Can go. We hit up, light up a torch, and we rush through this dungeon here real quick. That's super fast. I'm not used to that anymore. And I have to. Oops! I have to go there. And I want to flee because. And everyone has to die because why not? Start run. Everyone has to die because I am faster without any of these people. Die already? Okay, very nice. Thank you. And over here. And probably over here. Very good. Let me check. I have to go this way. I have to go that. I have to be careful to not. Um, to not lose my sense of direction right now. I have to go this way. And I want to find an amulet. I want to find a luck chain that is hidden somewhere in this dungeon here. Let me see. I think it's somewhere over here. I think it is over here. Maybe here? No, that's just gold. Then it should be somewhere in here. Hopefully, if it is, we can try and implement this into the run. No, it's not. It's not. Damn it. Okay, not, 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 not satisfying. Okay, we have to find the luck chain. I should have prepared myself for that. Can you please? So you get the document piece, obviously. Not a big deal, but we also run into the wrong direction very often. And we go this way and we uh, find the. We find the uh, speed amulet, I think. Yeah, the speed amulet. And hopefully the luck chain is not hidden somewhere in one of these stupid. Oh, I cannot. Can I? Can I pick the lock, please? Zira should be able to do that because she has. I think she has the highest lock picking skill. But she's not. Oh, eventually she is. And also, no lock chain. Why did I do that? It doesn't make any sense. Anyway, I want to see. Uh, yeah, I want to find the lock chain, basically. That's what I want to do. Where is it? Where is it? Where is the lock chain? Ah, uh, yeah. I know that there is a lock chain somewhere here. Is it down there? That would be not very... Um, that would be very unfortunate because it's, I, it's... It will probably take too long to get there. Also, we have another door that we can examine. Okay. So, we're down here. Which we are basically searching for something. A chest. Preferably a chest. Oh, that was too slow. Doesn't matter. There's one chance that we got. Hopefully, when we go in here, there's another chest here. 
And if this contains the luck chain, that would be nice. It doesn't. Oopsie. It doesn't. It's just a jewel chain. It doesn't do anything. So we have to search and we have to do the stupid stuff, which is go in here. And let's try and find the luck chain. Just some gold. Oh, where it is? Uh, where is it? I don't know. Okay, there's an attack. I want to find that luck chain. If it's too far away, it's probably not worth it to do that. It's just gold in here. Just gold. Again. <sighs> stupid, stupid, stupid. Over there. Over there, I believe. No, oh, that's not right. Oh, it is. Okay. Nope. There's nothing in here except gold. Okay, it's it's too far away, of course. Only gold in here. So the problem is, oh no, to find a luck chain, we would have to. Let me think for a moment. But yeah, I think we would have to go there. We have been in here. Okay. Uh, we would have to solve this puzzle here. Which is kind of slow. Where am I? Over here. Oh, it's moving in a different direction. Very nice. Huge fireball. I cannot even examine. Oh, I died. Oopsie. Load the game. Uh, I want a luck chain. Huh. There's still a solution to that. Uh, let me see. Uh, yes. Oh, gravity and political affair. Okay, one more thing. I can just buy a luck chain later in the game, which means I would have... I need it in Camulon anyway, so it doesn't matter if we... Uh, oopsie. I have to do that. If we buy it a little, la a little later in the game, so it doesn't matter that much. Well, I was completely wrong. It doesn't matter that much, so I can I can still um, utilize the luck chain feature, I suppose. And that would be preferable to do that. To find a solution to speed up the lava pit a little bit. That's what I actually want to do right now. Speed up the lava pit in Camelon. Uh, yeah, that was right. I have to do that, I have to go over here, get into a fight, and also do not mess up the direction. I have to go over here, and go in here, and over here. So there's a group of enemies here, which makes it a little bit harder to do that. Let me manipulate that. It will release a fireball, it will get me an attack. And the fireball will do something. I'm not really sure what it does, but I, let me grab the speed amulet anyway, because I want to be faster than these enemies. I want to be the very best, the fastest of them all. Oops, I have to... I have to toggle between right click and left click, just to do that. And that's the reason why we buy a lockpick from Vania in very early game, just to avoid doing that, having to do that. Let me see if I can somehow pick that lock any time in the future. Just give me a sign when you are ready to be picked with the lock. Okay. Finally, as 
if it would mean anything. It really doesn't. It just speeds up this um, these fights a little bit. I have to go there, I have to go there. And I have to find a solution to... Well, what I have to do with these walls. Now the firewall should hit the wall from this side. And I don't know what I have to do here. Now it moves the wall a little bit further. And when I do that, will it give me another fireball? Yes, it does. Where do I have to put this wall? Maybe over here? I don't have a single clue. I do not have a single clue what I have to do here. I really don't. Um, let's see. I have to... I just want to solve that riddle to see if I have the chance to get that luck chain somehow. Maybe I have to look it up. <laughs> okay, two more, I believe. Go away. Wait a little bit. I'm really not sure where this luck chain seems to be. Should be somewhere here. Should have been somewhere. Okay, one more. Yeah, of course you are too far away. Just do it. Come on. Come on, you can do it. I think it has something to do with this hallway there that is behind these walls. Maybe. Maybe not. What happens if I hit those switches at the same time? Ah! That happens. Ooh, crazy. Does it break? Yes, it does. Ooh, that's cool. I solved it. <laughs> I didn't know that I would be possible to solve that. Finally, I'm not faster than Rinri's. It doesn't matter too much. And I have to light up the cave a little bit. I could also use glitches. Okay, that's just a protection amulet. We do not need that. We want the luck chain, please. But as I said, I can uh, utilize the luck mechanic anyway, just by getting that chest. No, just by buying a luck chain. Ah, here it is. Ah, it's a thing that Meltas can use. It increases his spell points by a lot. Spell points 20. Spell points. 20. Ah, of course, he has 20 spell points. Uh, let's check that later. Um, let's see. Spell points 20, max spell points, but it increases his maximum spell points by 30, and also his life points. And also, Smeltus is the only person who can use that, I believe. Yes. It's only usable by Meltos. It's only used by, by a druid. This is a cool thing, I actually need that. <laughs> I actually need that in, a, in my casual playthrough, but I never found it because I was not able to solve that stupid riddle here. Anyway, there's another chest over here. No, that's the that's the other thing. Okay, that's the only... Where is the luck chain? Where is the luck chain? It should be somewhere here. But it hasn't been anywhere here. So, you don't have to solve that riddle, you do not have to search over here. Where is the luck chain? It should be somewhere here. It should be, oh no, that's the wrong way. 
Um, well, I am surprised, to be honest. I ne never expected that. I never expected it to be that hard to find that stupid luck chain. Or is it somewhere he in here? Is there a chest somewhere in here? No. No, of course not. I would see that, probably. Or would I? Or would I not? Let's see. There's nothing in here. It's just this one, this one hallway. Nope. Give me the luck chain. I also think that I found it in my last playthrough, so it should be somewhere here. But I opened every door. I checked every door. Also, I want to. I can actually. Let me do something real quick. Let me speed up that stuff here. Let me speed up the fights a little bit. Also, I want to go as much as... Yeah, do that. Uh, let me check. Yes, yes. Ah, here we are. Here we are. Okay, now I can see all the chests. There is one chest here, also I can see all the enemies. And I should have done this earlier, <laughs> obviously. Where is the luck chain? Also, just if you if you do not like cheating at all, uh, you have to look away, I suppose. So just cover your eyes, because this is heavy, heavy cheating here. As you can see, I can go out of bounds and stuff. I can do all the crazy stuff, like I can also teleport myself into or to every location on the map, basically. Uh, I have searched that chest as well. Yes, I did, the luck chain. I searched that chest as well. Where am I? Ah, here I am. I searched that. There's no luck chain whatsoever. I searched that pile of trash. That pile of trash, I'm sorry. Um, nothing in here except some stupid gold that I do not need. I also checked this the chest here. Contained this amulet but no evidence or trace of any luck chain just a jewel chain and the jewel chain does not do anything it doesn't increase luck ah now we can check what this thing does ah yeah luck plus 20 Five, but this doesn't it's not utilizable it's not useful in um, the speed run like I wanted to have no there's no luck chain here what is happening <laughs> I'm just go I'm so 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 sad well you know what wall I do not care uh, just a just a little bit of gold. Just a little bit of gold. Just some gold, I believe. Yes. Still no luck chain. There should be a luck chain here. At least the wiki that I consulted says so. So it should be available somewhere. No, no luck chain. Oh, there's a pile of... Wait a minute. Just wait a minute. Nope, no luck chain. That would be very cool if it was here. Hmm. 
Nah, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. Do I have the money to buy a luck chain finally? Nothing else is here. There's absolutely nothing. And this chest, however, contains the amulet, the power amulet. Still no luck chain. Oh no, lava. Whoever sees the amulet will die. Must die. But you can just walk through walls here. Still no luck chain. Did I search every single chest? I believe I did. I think so. Did I search every single pile of trash here? I believe I did. Ah, just a little bit of gold. Just a little bit of gold. Just some... Ooh, some gold. And just some gold. So I searched this one, this one, that one. I have to search this one. Gold. I have to search this one. Gold. Uh, nope, there is no luck chain. Not a single piece of whatever. Closed chest, yeah, that doesn't matter. It's not here. There's no luck chain here. Why isn't there any trace of a luck chain? Do I have some now? Do I already have it? No. Don't. One more thing that we have to check is it is there I think I You know what? I got a luck chain. I know that. I know it for a fact. Oopsie. Have to go this way. Uh, no, that's not right. Absolutely not. Have to go this way. It's... Is it somewhere here? But I don't think so. Also, I can walk through everything right now. Yes, with chests, I cannot steal from. I cannot even steal from Contos despite him being a very evil person. Hey boy. I know that, but I really, really, really want to find that stupid luck chain that you have somewhere here. Of course you don't. Because you're a liar and an evil person and nobody trusts you. Except all these people here. I still want to have that luck chain. Stupid. Let me check that real quick. There has to be some solution to that. I have to do that. Let's see. Mm. Oh no! Well, it appears that it's really... It's way different than I thought. I know that in my casual playthrough I have the luck chain. But I do not know, I do not remember where I got it. But, it appears that, really, this guy has a luck chain. And to check that, we can do that. We can do something. We can just go and... Oh, did we... 
Yes, we have the document. Okay, Contos has the luck chain, which means I would have to take it from his cold dead hands. Or neck, in that case. Mm. Also, when you have the cheat menu on, when the cheat menu is turned on, with this little cute face down here, then you can just skip through all the text almost immediately. Which is pretty, pretty handy. But not usable in the speedrun because we do not want to cheat. So this is cont- oh, I have to do this and I have to do that. This is Contos and he has 600 HP and we cannot really fight him. He could use magic. Magic. He could use Thorn Snare, but we do not know the spell yet. Okay, that's way too slow. We have to buy it. I can also just end the combat and see. Yeah, he has a luck chain. <laughs> there, I got the luck chain. The early luck chain. The early one. Yes, I do not need any of his crap. Now we killed Contos and restored peace until eternity. But this is not useful. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I still have another idea, but let me check the walkthrough again. We look quick. The first appearance of Luck Chain in the walkthrough is No, let me check the layout of Contos dungeon. Okay, history lesson. Find the man in red and talk to him. He's Melta's friend. Yes, I already did that. When you leave his hut, Zero will comment on the situation. She does. Now enter the, sh the hut self this. There will be a battle trainer who teaches close combat, long range combat and critical hit. We already know that. But he's only available from 8 to 9 a.m. So we do not use that. We would have to wait. No matter what you do with a knot, the guard of Contos dungeon. Climb down. Move into the west door and search the barrel in the southwest corner. Contains 5 red potions and 12 green healing potions. The far east door resides Contos, whom we will visit later. Oh, yes, we do. For now, take the north exit on this corridor. In this room, now open the southeast door and another door and step on the first blue floor plate and retreat and then run across the three floor plates to open the door. We already do that all the time. In this area you will fight some Rinri, we do not do that. Then run away once you kill their companions of... Ah yeah. What I want to say is, if you kill one Rinri, all the other ones will just run away and you will not get the experience, I believe. No, you do, you do, you do get experience from uh, monsters that escaped, but anyway. Continue through the northwest door to enter a room of colored floor plates, doesn't matter. Step on the plate to make the walls this order. Blue, blue, pink, yellow, green, yellow, doesn't matter. So to trash for a total of 60 gold pieces. Absolutely not useful. Go through the north door and turn west into the fake wall. Yes, passage leading down the stairs. Keep going west until you reach a room with a door and a chest. Power amulet. Yes. Yes. Um, down the stairs, find the switch on the east wall, pull it under the gap in the south, choose the west door. Open the chest. Jewel chain, color map. Correct. Yeah, no luck chain, basically. Let me just search for luck. Luck, luck chain. Yep. That's the first appearance. Luck chain. Next. Uh, oh, sorry, next. Ah, yeah. The next luck chain that you can obtain in the game, which is actually the second and the only one. There are only two luck chains in the whole game. 
obviously. So the next luck chain that you can obtain is sold by diamond polishers in Umayo Kenta. That's the only way to do that. And the luck chain costs about 325 gold pieces. Well, yeah, this is before Srimalinar. Uh, this is going to be difficult. I imagined that to be easier, a lot easier. Srimalina, Sierra, Equipment Maker Dungeon, second floor. Do we get some... Stop it. Do we get some money in the Equipment Maker Dungeon? I do not think so. So we just leave. Nope, wrong door. Also, in cheat mode, we do not have to open doors anymore. But we have to check how much gold do we have. Basically, enough. Did we buy Goddess Wrath? We did. Why do we have so much gold? It's insane. It's actually pretty insane, but we can do something. We can go here, in here. And who is the merchant here? Is it you? Okay, some. sometimes there is someone around you. Probably not. Where is the merchant? Ah, I think he's up here. Not in the void, obviously. Is it you? Yes, you sell a luck chain for 325 gold, which is amazing. But we have a lot of gold. Why do we have so much gold? I think that's wrong. I think that's wrong. Ah, yes, I know. I know. I understand. The reason why I have so much gold is because I didn't buy any spell scrolls, I believe. <laughs> no. I had to think for a moment, because there is a way to utilize that. We can use it. Basically, we can use a glitch in the game. There's a gold glitch. Let me show it to you. Let me just show it to you. We can basically do that. We can um, put all our gold on Tom. Or, yeah, I think on Tom, on one character. Just doesn't matter which character you choose, but yeah, 904 gold. We can put one point, uh, 0 0.1 gold pieces to every character, which is a very, very unfair distribution, <laughs> which means the calculation algorithm completely freaks out when I buy something. So I have 904 gold still. And I buy a luck chain for 325 gold pieces, which means I would have to pay 325 gold pieces, which I don't. I just pay something around 80 gold pieces, which is... It's, yeah. That's a nice outcome. So we still have these gold pieces and everyone has zero gold. So the game algorithm just subtracts every gold from every character until there's nothing left and then the rest from this character. But somehow the distribution makes or um, uh, matters, so to speak. So now we have 50 luck. And what we want to do is, we want to get another item that gives us an additional luck boost of 35. 
points, which means we would have, or it turns out that we, in the end, would have 85 luck, which means we can basically survive almost every trap with a very high chance. Which means we can skip the lava room in Camulon. Basically. Okay, the luck chain. We have to buy the luck chain. How much money do we have left? Let me check that real quick. Let me check that real quick. I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but I have to... I have to do that. Come on. Not. I do... I do that. And I do that. How much money do we have left when we are... Uh, there, in Umayo Kent. Uh, do we know that? Okay, there's a thing that we buy before we leave, I think. Let's see. Okay, there's the Toronto, then we are at the G counters, and we... Go and buy some th stuff. Spell scrolls. We go and buy some spell scrolls, and after that, we have some money left, and we can still utilize. We have one thousand seven hundred. Uh, basically, we have a lot of money left. I think we can just buy the luck chain. Maybe utilize the cheat so that it does not do that much damage to our... but we do not need so many. We still have to buy the red and violet potions. Or no, the blue potions and the violet potions. We still have to buy them. I think I can... I think I can do that. I think I can just do that. Let me close all that stuff here and put that over here again. Then maybe start a run. With that in mind. But for that, I want to use the other version. Come on. Can you please? 